Because if he's telling you that I'm not, I'm not your dude, but he's comfortable. Dudes will, okay. will get comfortable. You want to cook? I don't come here every night. Mm -hmm. You want to do this? I do this and that. Mm -hmm. But in their mind, they like, when it's time to go, I want to still have that foot out the door when it's time to leave. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. You have, so that he's communicating that you're not my girl. I never say that on my mouth. Mm -hmm. We just schooling. Why she can't take that? Why, is, why did that really have to be his so, girl? I'm going I'm to I'm tell you where women fuck up. Okay. We got to get back to... <laughs> Shit. We do. We we can edit this motherfucker. We need this before this we get it. Let's know what we <laughs> need. Hold that thought. Hold that thought. <laughs> hold that thought. Hold the bed, motherfucker. <clears throat> but tell you why the fuck we do what we do when we say we do it. <laughs> Damn it. It's like nah. But um, yeah. I mean, you you gotta tell your friends the truth, man. All in all, you have to. You have to. I think that's your safety blanket. You have to have a relationship with your friend that. Well, I'm, I'm the type of friend. If I fuck up, tell me. Cause I promise you, if I fucked up, I didn't. I didn't do it on purpose. I don't know. I, I don't fuck up on purpose. So my nigga, you if you see me fuck up, tell me I fucked up. You fucked up. Cause now you right here. <laughs> see it be your delivery. <laughs> he lying. It be your now delivery. Now you lying. You didn't fuck up. One of, one of Molly G's most famous quotes is, "I don't seek permission." I seek forgiveness. I seek forgiveness. On purpose. So that means he gonna be he gonna do some fucked up shit. Yeah. But when I get caught, <laughs> so I need that forgiveness. So what <laughs> that means, yeah. So that means you know you be fucking up. I said some people got dumb ass friends. I never said I wasn't one of them. But why you gonna communicate that you scared? Absolutely. Don't be scared now. Uh oh, don't be scared. Don't be scared. <laughs> don't be scared. Look, now, absolutely. for me, for me, I can't tell on my friends the truth. What? You got some super dumbass friends, though. I can't tell my friends the truth. But why can't yeah. you? Because it hurt feelings, number one. And number two, sometimes you just have to lead by example. If you want somebody to be successful or something like that, they have to see you doing something first. And then they, when they see you doing it and they be like, oh, that shit easy, that's when they want to do it. But see, that be the problem. Yeah, Ain't shit they, easy. Yes, and all, mm -hmm. most of the time, they can turn into a leech. Yeah, yeah. because, see, mm -hmm. this, is, this is the problem with that statement. Your friend sees it and says that that shit is easy. No, your friend sees you on the back end when you're up. Uh -huh. exactly. When you're looking good, when you done put five to ten years of hard exactly. work into this motherfucker, yeah. and now it's time to fun. He see you funning, and that shit looks fun. Well, so so what? I, that's what it take for some some people though. Oh, that's a long time. Baby. Hey, look, if, if, you gotta get on this rocket ship when it's when it's boarding. Yeah, but I'm you just saying, saying, some people can't take. Some people will look at you like, how the fuck you want to tell me? How to get to somewhere if you're not even there. Mm. But just because I'm not there doesn't mean I don't have the knowledge. A lot of times, I've gone through more stuff than you have. And my circumstances are different than yours. So, I'm trying, as your friend, I'm trying to tell you, hey, bro, I've been there. I've done that. And it got me here. Mm -hmm. You have the option to not get to where the fuck I am if you do right. Yeah. But, motherfucker got to hear that. Mm -hmm. that or that means, sometimes they don't they but what I'm yeah, telling you is they don't bring it. That's why I said you can't tell them. So that's why I said you can't tell them sometimes. You just got to let a motherfucker do them. Or they got to see you by example. That's why I'm saying. like, Okay, so when do we get to the point where you communicate this friendship is over because I'm here and you're there? I don't really think I had. Well, I have, have had, to, to, I've had to communicate a friendship is over. And the best way to communicate that shit is to stop managing them. Motherfucking phone. <laughs> <laughs> that's not communicating. That is communicating. That's ghosting. Yeah. I'm going to tell you why it's communicating. If you call a motherfucker and they don't answer, what's your immediate talk? They busy. Uh -huh. They can't talk right now. Something. Mm -hmm. oh, this if you call a motherfucker no. 20 times mm -hmm. and they ain't answering, okay, ain't no more busy. Yeah, they ain't no good. more doing something. That's, oh, something's up. Yeah. Yeah, yeah they, something's they up. Don't message you no that's the way they're going to run into you, though. That's fine. What's up? I can tell you. Then he tells them they're going to run into you. No, I ain't worried about that. I'm not <laughs> ducking nobody. Yes. About nothing. Fine. My whole thing is. You is. Because you ducking that phone call. Go ahead. <laughs> My whole thing is. <laughs> I don't. The people who that I was friends with. I would distance myself from them. Without like. 
totally communicating like I'm I don't fuck with you like because at the end of the day if we out in the streets and you getting your ass beat by somebody that we don't know I'm gonna help you you know what I'm saying so it's not really like but I'm not your friend no more it's more like but there is a such thing as growing apart bro. yes yeah, that's, that's what, what I'm saying. saying that's yeah. what I'm saying it's distance. you can still help somebody you got that you're growing apart from you got your yeah. own mission I got my own mission but when we come together I mean I'll fuck with you awesome Drinking shit or some of this. I just know I can't fuck with you on every day, every day level. Or I can't fuck with you on a certain type of mission. Like I have a goal in mind. If you're not trying to reach these goals, or you, if you're not trying to Help further you. yourself or anything to that nature, grow. I can't fuck with you. I'm gonna leave you where you are. But it's it, there is a <clears> such <throat> thing as having different goals. Mm -hmm. It is a such thing as having two different paths. Mm -hmm. yeah. It is a such thing as having two. Like everybody's journey is different. Yeah. So just because my journey is different than yours, don't mean that we're not friends, my nigga. Yeah. That just means our day to day is changed. Yeah. I don't give a fuck who you are and how close we are, my nigga. I can't be around you every day no more. Mm -hmm. At this age, bro, you got life. You got Jeez, you got children. children out here. You got significant others out here, yes. and you got the get how the fuck out my face really? syndrome. Yes, like. <laughs> how do you Communicate with somebody every single day. day. Nigga, I just went to work. I got home. I went like to the gym. Every I'm home. Single day. Yeah. It's, it's, it's not your per it's just not your significant other that can't happen. Exactly. And I don't even like doing that with I don't even want that with significant other. But I have to. If I have to. No, if you live together. Then. I'm trying to. But even when I'm you trying live to together. communicate every day. With your significant other? Yes, indeed. So, no, I don't have a problem with communicating, but I don't want to be around you. But being around you <laughs> does not mean like. Oh my god. No, you can live in the same household. Like I feel like when you live in the same household, you gotta have your neutral corners. Yeah. You know what I mean? A man gotta have a man cave. A woman gotta have her her whatever the fuck y'all so, call y'all shit. Right. So why is, oh, why is communication so important within us a, a relationship with significant other? Ooh, man! Somebody, a significant other is a person that you share most of your time with, right? So oh. if you share. Okay, I mean most of your time in the sense of you gotta go to work, mm -hmm. you gotta do whatever activities you're gonna do outside of home. Mm -hmm. At home, you're spending all the time with them because they, they share that space with you. Mm -hmm. But to that person, you're, they're gonna see the most. They're gonna see vulnerable. They're gonna see. They're gonna see every emotion you have. Mm -hmm. So you have to communicate with them so they know how to deal with you one mm -hmm. and help you two when you're going through those emotions. Mm -hmm. That's why I think. It's very important or it's valuable to have that communication. I think communication is very important because um, <clears throat> y'all have to be, if not on the same page, around the same chapter. Like, y'all have to know. Same book, different chapter? No. If you, you say the same chapter? I, you got to be on the same chapter because with that being said, if um, I'm at this position and I'm trying to get you to this possession. You got to be reading with me. It's got to be some type of growth. So I have to communicate with you. So I let you know. And this page, da da da. And in this metaphorically, and this page, da da da, is going to happen. I need you to read up on that and get hit to it, so you can be able to do what you have to do when we have a conversation about it. But sometimes you might have to That's read that page um, with them. Yes. <laughs> I'm gonna say, sometimes you might have to read that page with well. yes, I'm gonna say, oh my god, we got pages and now I gotta read it to get up to the <laughs> <do that. laughs> Right. But she get the bullshit. She gonna say, will tell your motherfucker that hey, exactly. you need to read these I'm pages because yeah, I'm gonna be Yeah, this is a lot. I'm like, yeah. Lord have mercy. But I, what I'm saying though, like, is, baby, you got chapter three, I'm just I'm just getting on chapter six. <laughs> 